it's um it's creative to be honest i mean he puts um things in his little his little mind to a lot of the plays even though it's a lot of the same concepts but he just puts his little his little thing to it is there any major adjustments that you were looking to make coming into camp that you really wanted to work on um me personally just getting um in and out my routes um a little faster and um just um clearing up my releases and making them more you know believable I definitely try to. Who's the toughest DB in practice? Uh, tough. I think all our DBs is um, really good. So um, toughest, I can't really say. All of them really good. Give us a um, challenge. When you, you the next uh, kick return? Kick return? Uh, yes, sir. You, you and Henry raced maybe 10 times at the 40-yard dash. Who wins the majority of those races? Um, it can be a split, but uh, Rose won the last one, so you got to go with the last last one. What are those kind of like friendly back and forth like, whether it's at practice or in the locker room or just on social media, we see sometimes like, not just you and Rug, but all the receivers kind of have mm -hmm. a back and forth. What, what are those like? Um, it's just a little competition. We like to uh, compete against each other, just on the field, off the field. We're really, we really competitive. So, I mean, it's all friendly, you know, nothing to it really. Just like to have fun. So who's the best? Uh, Say uh, video games or y'all compete. Like, who are some of the better? Um, I'm not a gamer, to be honest. Um, I know that um, Smitty, Smitty and Rugs really good at 2K. Madden, uh, Judy is really good at Madden, so I know that for sure. But me, I'm out there. I'm out. So what's the one thing you're really good at that you can beat everybody else at? Uh, I don't know yet. When I do, a basketball shooting, shooting. I think I'm the best basketball shooter. Look back to last what did year. You learn, uh, about route running from uh, Jerry Judy? Um, just watching him. He run our pretty, pretty, well, really good routes. So just watching him play, you know, I pick up on some uh, stuff he do, so. What does he do specifically good about, I mean, just like, is it the stems that he creates, or I mean, how, how, is he, how does he do it? I mean, you have to ask him what he, how he do the stuff that he do, so. I don't know, y'all yeah, watch them play. Have you spent any time in the cooling chamber, the new cooling chamber at practice? The the tents? Uh, the new? The, the cooler, the cryo chamber where it gets really cold. Oh, no, I, I don't be in there. Oh, okay. Really going there. When you talk about like making your routes more believable, can you just like expand on what you mean by that? Just like in terms of like kind of fooling DBs? Is that what you're talking about? Oh, yeah, like setting up DBs and making them uh, go where I want them to go so I can uh, get out my route. Okay. Do the, do the DBs on the team kind of help you with that? Like help you get inside the mind of what? Opposing defensive backs are thinking. Uh, definitely, definitely. Cause I DB so, so good, and it really just uh, make me work and really make me like try to give them more. You think back to last year, there was that play against Tennessee, and I know some of us were talking about that, the touchdown pass, the longer pass to you last year. Where does that one rank in your mind in terms of one of your better plays? Um, I think it was a pretty good play. I think it was a uh, tool really placing it right there on the money really made the play. Is there any else other passes that you caught that stood out as maybe one of your your moments? Uh, no, nah, not really. How about on punt return? Uh, you, you made some good plays there. Is just anything that stands out? Uh, punt return, nah, not really. Was it frustrating though? It seems at the beginning of the season you, you got a lot of opportunities and then teams started kicking away from you. How, what is that? What is your mindset on that? Uh, I had to adjust because um, it was my first year back there. So, you know, everything was new to me. So. When they started um, kicking away stuff, I wasn't really uh, aware of that kind of thing, especially being new to college kickoff uh, punt return. So it was it was new. Is the key to a good punt return just making the first guy miss? Um, I think uh, the key is the punt return team, the people that's blocking for them. You know, they really got to do their job in order for you to do yours. So I think that's how good make a real good punt return. How good is the punt return team here? I think they I think it's really good, really good. So did you do much of it in high school, punt return? Oh, uh, yes, sir. Did, did people not kick away from you there? Uh, they really didn't kick it to me. They really didn't. They kick it out of bounds, so I go for it. What is it about the slot position that, that kind of allows your spatial awareness, movement in space to kind of uh, play up, you know, to, to work on that? Um, I think it's a, a great position for the things that I can do. You know, personally, just um, some of my skill set is uh, go really well. but um, I like to play outside um, a lot too.
Last year, what we heard a lot about Coach Gaddis is like detail. Like he's very detail oriented, right? What is kind of Coach Wiggins' big thing? Like the main thing about his personality or his coaching style that sticks out to you? Definitely, he's definitely big on detail and the little things. You know, he really wants you to do the little things right. Um, real big on uh, ball security, making sure that um, say the he always say ball is the most important thing in the program. So he real, real, real big on uh, ball security. We hear that uh, Shaheem is one of the smarter players on the defense. Kind of analyzes, knows kind of what you're gonna do before you do it. What are those battles like with, with him? Whether he's at star or at safety? Um, it, it's a mind game. You know, Shaheem's um, been. Been in all way, so um, his deception is, is uh, really good, and me and him have some uh, real good battles. So, <laughs> so uh, <laughs> speaking, speaking on you right now, man. Speaking on you. Yeah. Maybe we could see you a little bit more outside this year. Um, I hope so. I hope so. But um, in game plan, do whatever. Talked a lot about f four receiver sets. Is that something that excites you? Uh, getting a chance to be on the field with. Jerry and Henry and Fonte. Um, yeah, I mean that's pretty exciting. Just um, us four being all on the same field, so I think it's I think it's pretty cool. How much can that? Do you think that can open up the offense even more so than it was last year? Uh, Around the four wide sets. Uh, I hope so. You know, I think it's a unique, um, unique style, and um, four pretty uh, pretty good wideouts. Be pretty As good far, out there. Where do you think the offense goes in general? Just to another year and then you're another year and then. Um, I just think the uh, offense gonna be uh pretty pretty good, you know, if we uh do the little things right and play how we supposed to play, I think that offense would be, be we'll be alright.